Hello and welcome to 108 South Wolf Creek here in Brookville. Here we have a four bedroom, two full bath home sitting on about a half acre of land. House is built in 1907, sits in downtown Brookville. And this land structure runs from over here, this whole grass, all the way to the back creek line. And it does have this wraparound driveway. We'll take a look at that as we're walking through here. All right, it does have the front porch here. Really nice wrapped around front porch. Does have central air, sits on a full basement. Let's work our way around the outside of this property. I'm gonna zoom out just a little bit there. Okay, we make our way down this driveway and this driveway is part of the property. It kind of runs straight back. You can see the trees back there. Those trees are that property line. So it will run all the way down back to the creek here. work our way around side entryway here zoom back out for you and then the trees over here is where that property line ends it's kind of on a slight angle now additional parking pad back here the back of the house for you it does have a storage shed and it does have a walkout portion to the full basement and then you've got a secondary side entry here as well here's that yard space back here for you absolutely love the outside of this property and how much land you have it's very rare to get a half acre of land in town anywhere so really nice all righty we've taken a look at the outside of the property let's make our way in the front door and take a look inside Okay, we've made our way in the front door here, and it's going to bring you right into the formal living room area. You see here lots of natural hardwood throughout the home. These rooms are absolutely massive. Turn to the right here, it's going to bring you into a huge living room. That is brand new carpet. And then we're going to make our way around into what is the first bedroom here. It is on the first floor, so that does make it kind of convenient having that first floor bedroom. And then in this room, you actually have your own full bath as well. So that's bathroom number one, full bathroom. We also have a second full bath upstairs. Now it does have a circular floor plan that works around the kitchen here. So we're gonna go this way into the kitchen. This door to the right here is actually gonna take you out to this little mud room that comes off the driveway to the right. <coughs> into the kitchen here. Right here is where your range and fridge would go. To the right here is an additional little pantry space. Work our way through another pantry space over here on the opposite side. So plenty enough pantry space here, no doubt about it. Then it's gonna work us back towards the kitchen. That door there is gonna take us down to the full finished basement. And then there's a secondary mudroom here on this side of the home as well. So you really get two mudrooms for the entrance portion of the house here. And then it's gonna bring us right back in to that formal dining room. All right, we've taken a look downstairs. Let's make our way upstairs. We've made our way to the top of the steps here, and it's gonna bring us right here to the right when you come up to the top of the steps. It's going to be huge bedroom here, brand new carpet, freshly painted. To the left is this massive loft. It's probably the biggest room in the house outside of the living room. It is this loft. Use it as a family room. Use it as an additional bedroom space if you'd like tons of space in this home over 2,000 square feet now this door is going to take you out to the covered roof over the porch the owner says she has never used that for anything other than just opening the door and letting it air out up here if you want fresh air coming through she said she's never actually used that upper unit for anything else but that work away in here into the second bedroom upstairs third overall hardwood floors here all the windows have been updated in the house here's the closet there now, anywhere you see carpet or additional flooring, there is hardwood underneath that is ready to be finished if you so choose to do that. Now, let's make our way into the second full bathroom here. It's a rather large bathroom. Work our way around. It does have an old claw foot soaking tub in here, which makes that really nice. So bathroom number two. Now, off of this bathroom, it's going to take you into a little area for doing the, the makeup, additional closet space here. Work our way back through and then into this back bedroom, which is the fourth bedroom in the home. Fifth, if you're gonna count that loft there as a potential bedroom space. And then you're gonna have closet space here. 
as well as closet space here. This is the smallest bedroom of the home. As you can see, it does have the hardwood floors in here ready to refinish. Take one last look upstairs. Again, we're at 108 South Wolf Creek Street in Brookville. A fantastic four bedroom home offering over 2,000 square feet. Ready for you to put your final touches on it. Thanks and have a great day.